Dinah, Sunny, and I are heading down to Pedal Lake. The lake isn't our objective, however, but it is en route for our ascent of Cauldron Peak. Cauldron Peak looks close, but we'll be ascending the backside of the mountain. Now on the flats, we head to the forest ahead of us. Above the forest, a lateral moraine winds to the right. We'll head through the forest, follow Pedo Creek, and then go up the moraine. We've gone through the forest, and now the waters will soon converge into a single creek. The ridge on the left is the moraine we'll be climbing. After following it, we'll pass above the double waterfall. Now the valley narrows into a canyon. We'll soon hike along the creek. We make our way to a log bridge that crosses the creek. Now we start up the lateral moraine. Behind us are the flats and the forest we hike through, and there's Pedo Lake. After the moraine, we follow a trail etched in a scree slope. Cauldron Peak is to our right, but before we head to it, we have to reach Cauldron Lake. There's Cauldron Lake. Unfortunately, the weather didn't live up to the forecast. We expected to be hiking under blue skies right now, but we've seen no sign of the sun. We're only a couple of minutes from the lake now. Cauldron Lake is a beautiful alpine lake, a worthwhile destination in itself. We'll take turns crossing at the end of the lake. After the lake, there is no trail, but it's easy to cross the gentle slopes. Then it starts raining. Cauldron Peak is barely visible in the background on the right. For the rest of our trip, it rains on and off. Around the next bend, we'll see the summit. The summit is above the gray scree slope. Dinah and I are discouraged by the rain and the climb ahead, but we follow Sunny, who is focused on getting to the summit. When we heard thunder in the distance, we stopped and considered turning back, but we saw no evidence of a nearby storm and continued on. We finally make it to the summit ridge. The summit is very close now. By this time, we are all cold and wet. We take our last steps to the top of Cauldron Peak. Given the conditions, we're all surprised that we made it. <laughs> 